Some years back, when I was much younger than I am right now, I used to hear people say something that I found very strange and I was sure was a lie. They used to say if you took away the money from all the rich people, all the people who have the money, took it, snatched it away from them and gave it to the people who do not have it, the poor people. And then you went away and then you came back after a few months, you would have found something very amazing. The money would have gone right back to the rich people, the people who have the money. Now many years ago in my naivety and lack of understanding, I was sure this was a lie. I mean, you give me money, I'm a poor person. Gosh, I'll never look back. I'll make more and more and more. And uh, I will never, it will never be snatched away from me again. I'll never lose it. <laughs> well, much older now, with much more experience, I can tell you that statement is absolutely true. 100%, 1000% true. But why? What is the difference between the people who have it and the people who do not have it? I know you guys are always used to me talking politics, but let's leave politics out of this. I'm not talking by rich, I don't mean the people who have grabbed our money. The people who have grabbed public coffers. No, no, no. I'm talking about ordinary people in day-to-day -day life who start a business, they work hard, they make money, they go to the farm, they plant maize, they plant coffee, they reap their, their sweat, they reap the rewards of their sweat. Those are the people I'm talking about. Okay? So, why is this true? It is true for a very simple reason. Skills and knowledge, that's all it is. The people who have it have, have gone through trial and error, most of them, and they have found the skills and the knowledge to generate money. That's as simple as it is. Give somebody who has no clue the money and they will lose it overnight. They don't have the skills, they don't have the knowledge to generate it. What you give them, they'll just spend until it's finished. Even if you give them 10 million, 50 million, oh, it's very easy to spend 10 million. I know most of you will not believe. It's very easy to spend 50 million just like that. Bam. Within a few months, you have no idea where the money went. That's life. Now let's look at it another way. You probably earn a small salary. You are comfortable. You pay your rent. You pay your bills and so on. Yeah. Now just take your income, take everything of yours, and hand it over to somebody with the right skills. What do you think is going to happen? Within a few months, your life will change. Your income will be up, your bank account will be bulging, you'll be rich. And they're using the income you have right now. They're not putting in anything more. For a very simple reason, they have the skills. They take that money, they invest it here, it brings a return, they invest it there, it brings a return. They do this, it generates money, and they make your money, the money which you have right now and are complaining is too little, they make it grow until you're just totally amazed. That's life. Now most Kenyans realized this a while back and they flooded our universities, they went and got degrees, they went and, uh, you know, and that's why our, our universities are doing very well. People are just signing up for courses every day, every evening, every night. People are just signing up, starting a university uh, degree course. Uh, some are doing bridging studies so that they can do a degree. That's all very good, yeah? But I'll tell you the sad reality. Many of those people have ended up disillusioned. Not because a degree is a bad thing, but because they have found it's a useless piece of paper. Yeah? The knowledge is good, the background is good, but it does not solve the immediate problem. Because most of those people went to university, most of those people have gone to de into de for degrees, apart of course from the ones who have, uh, politicians who have done it because it's a political requirement. You can't be a governor without a degree. I'm not talking about those people. Most of those people who have gone have ended up being disillusioned and disappointed because the degree did not make money for them. They can't find a better job with their degree because now everybody has degrees out in the same job market and the degree has not given them extra skills to improve their lives and make more money. I have a suggestion for you. All is not lost. The internet is your savior. This time don't look for a degree in um, anthropology to do. <laughs> or, or a degree in the science of mosquitoes <laughs> look for a practical course yeah and make it as direct as possible how to start a business for instance yeah that would be useful that would give you the necessary skills now there's a very interesting course we're running here in Kumekucha which has really benefited a lot of people and it's very direct how to make money online now some people have a wrong image about making money online because so many uh, funny funny businesses have come online but they've looked at the darker side instead of looking at the other end of the scale there's a multi-billion dollar company which does all its business online 
and it's called Google. Yes, everybody has heard of it. Yeah, that's an online business. So I'm not saying you're going to start your business and it, it becomes like Google, like magic. No. But the journey of a thousand miles starts with a single step. Why don't you start your small business online? And the way to do it is to follow these tutorials, which you have the Kumekucha tutorials, which will take you only two months to complete. And we have a guarantee. By the time you finish those two months, you'll have started your online business. Now you may be listening to this and you're one of those people who are very busy. You have a very taxing job, very busy from morning till late in the evening. Don't worry. This course is perfect for you because it's just 15 minutes every day. Can you imagine that? Of course, there's a lot of material we can, we, and you can catch up on the reading and so on over the weekend in your own time. But every day, all you have to do is 15 minutes. Yeah? Every day you grow 15 minutes, 15 minutes. When two months are up, you have your own business. You have the skills, you have your own online business that you're running, which is generating income for you. Isn't that wonderful? And I'll tell you more. It's not theory. It's run by somebody who has been doing business online, who has been totally relying only on the online business from the year 2005. Yeah? So you'll not have any theories there. You'll have only practicals. Skills, practical skills that you can use today to change your life so that you will never again fear losing your job. You will never fear again retrenchment. A lot of that is going on right now. You will be your own independent person. Even while you're still at that job, you'll be able to build a business on the side that will be generating more and more income on you. A business that you can fall back on. Mambo Ikearibika Kazini. Therefore, I suggest don't waste another second more. Yeah, details are below in the description area of this video. You'll find full details on how you can enroll for these video tutorials that will give you the skills. My friend, what you need are the skills, not a piece of paper. You need the skills that you'll be able to turn into an income for you, an extra income for you. Yeah? Thank you very much. This is Chris Kumakuja.